Hello guys, welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Bastion. I am Levy, the Amish man, the Amish gamer. Yes, I know I said it, I don't care. It's been a while since I last recorded. I had a lot of things, went to a Kiss and Motley Crue concert, I enjoyed it. Had a lot of souvenirs from it, but that's not really important. In the last part, we went to a couple of areas to retrieve a couple of shards, but found out that Zulf and his men pretty much invaded the Bastion. And off screen, I upgraded a few of my weapons. Now, we're gonna go all the way back to the gate. But, first, let's make sure about something. Not the forge, but the arsenal. I don't really need that one very much, so I'm gonna take the breaker bow. And <laughs> the holy hand grenade. Yes, the holy hand grenade of Archiarch, or whatever you call it. Anyways, we're going to go to the Urzendra Gate. Yeah, the Urzendra Gate. So, let's go. And pretty much my throat and my nostrils and my sinuses aren't doing so great, so bear with me. One last shard. It's all we need to put this mess behind us. You got a and point mother, there, buddy. What a mess it is. <laughs> no kidding. A mess like that could have only been made by hand. Oh, this Those is where the invasion that failed. we decide to kill. The Urus stand as living proof of that. Crap. This is where we decide to get payback for them destroying the Bastion. Plus, we gotta go save uh, Zia from her ungodly demise from the Aura. Day one. This is day two. Part of the calamity was a simple idea. We never wanted to go to war again. Wanted to rule it out. Stop me, stop me. It's pretty much what we're gonna do. It's pretty much like afternoon now, or. Apocalypse so now all over again. Lives. We're going through the wild and killing all the wildlife or anything that moves actually just to get to Zia. We saw solutions far beyond the city. We traveled near as far Think. as the kids going right now. Day three. Morning. Oh I see you got a spear, so do I. I win. Yeah, first they come to kill us. Now we're going to get our revenge. It's pretty much what the title will be. This is called revenge. Part of it. Then there was a breakthrough. Oh, great. This is the reason why I kind of don't like the aura that much. The aura are very quick. You damage them enough, they almost die. But then they move. And I found something fancy. Something I actually do need. And let's go. It came from an era, a brilliant young scientist named Ven. Really? How is he special? Ven worked for the Mansus. Dusk of the third Showed day. His knives in the city's drawer. I see you over there. You tried to you tried With to sneak attack me. Mansus, failure. A way to seal the Ura tunnels shut. You have brought failure to your country. Just like that, every last era. Oh, day three. Night. Night to the final day, bitches. I tried to attack the kid. How dare you? This discovery was never to be. And now we're at day five. We skipped day four. Day four wasn't really that important. It's sad if you look at it. We're lucky to be alive. Yeah, lucky to be alive, and I fell to my death. Oh, he was already dead. But Ven didn't like being manipulated. He had plans of his own. Wait, what do you mean by he didn't want to be manipulated? This is does not sound good. Day six, afternoon. He skips a day, or the rest of the set it to blow up time periods. But it's raining shards, yay! Oi! Oh. 
I don't like gunfire. But I'm finding a lot of shards, though. That's a blessing. And we're at day seven dawn. But remember, the bastion can fix everything. We just need that shot. Oh, get the that surprise! That surprised me, good sir. Hey, the shard. Thank you. Wait a minute. Ow! Hey! It's too bad the URA ain't exactly been well. Boy, that's mine! Mind you bastards, I wanted that shard. And you used rabbits after me. How dare you? You know what? Fuck the tricks, rabbit. You deserve to die. For now, kid kept trying to steal my tricks as a kid. How dare he? Anyways. First things first, though. There's someone we figured needed rescuing. See ya. Well, yeah, that's what I was trying to find, but Zia, it wasn't there. But they took my shard. Why do those bastards take my shard? I hate this. I'm trying to find a shard. The Hura fell back, no doubt planning the next move, but we knew ours already. Oh, yes. I definitely know mine too. Actually, no, I'm not gonna buy something foul. Instead, looking around, I'm almost close to rebuilding the land, and I just need to buy a few more secrets. But I pretty much have to go with the dynasty just to get the secret skills, or not the country, but the service. All these require weapons, and this one requires you me to go into the the trial of the gods, the who knows where, just one trip. But that's gonna be impossible, isn't it? Well, not in what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna do some. There's something well, we had to pretty do much gonna do some proving grounds right now. The bellows first. Why the bellows? Oh. Ooh, you'll see why I'm gonna do the bellows. Welcome to Grady Incinerator, home of the hottest wings in East of Ceylandia. Hottest wings in seriousness, the East Incinerator was dumb, and it had a problem with Peckers. Isn't that what she said? Anyways, Bless the thing destroy the Peckers before the time runs out. Oh. Burn, Pecker, burn! We couldn't just torch them all at once. We had to use restraint. Wow, well, don't the Pekka's die. Nah, I'm not gonna do it in time, so... Going back to restart. Because I got the third prize. You're supposed to kill them all in a certain amount of time. But I'm going to restart. Know how we kept the city clean? We put all our trash in the greedy incinerator. Yeah, the incinerator. Maybe yeah, I should have the flames regenerate a lot quicker. Ooh, the cinders. Come on, man. Die, birdies. Oh, crap. I'm almost there. Keeping the incinerator clean. And I got second job, prize. But not pleasant one. Grand. At least I got something sharp. Puh. I think the reason why I kind of don't like the bellows that much is because you have to use all your money to buy upgrades. But, I will say that I got the cinder. And my microphone's getting brushed upon by my finger because I was itching my sideburns. You'd almost think those peckers like getting cooked. I was hoping they got cooked. It would have been more funny. Where's the cinders? I get 500. The cinders kept the city good and warm. Made it that actually sounds pretty nice and tasty. Where's 
let's see, something foul. Bone, no wonder. Because I didn't upgrade it enough. On the inside, a fire bellows ain't nothing like it's more popular. Because I need one more upgrade cousin. for it. Do I have something foul? Yes, I do. But the only problem is, I gotta go get more money. Yeah, a couple of things I need to do. Probably do something stringy, which I already did. Pretty much have to do the Fang Repeater. I'll come back to the bellows, but first, I'm going to do the, the Trapper Shingle. The only problem with the automatic or the fully automatic fire is that you cannot move. It's like basically if you're just running, 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 then stop no shooting a gun. Trapper Shingle for learning to tread light and shoot straight. Trappers had to tread real carefully. Else this one's very kind of difficult. They train because... themselves by clearing out the targets while not clearing out the floor. See, kind of the reason why. But I am lucky. Any good For one important knows reason. To take a step till the time is right. Because I got a lot of clips. A lot of ammo. The clips actually a good thing. But the only problem is you gotta run while you do this because if you don't, you're gonna fall. Luckily, I got an upgrade, so I have a lot of clips. And I destroyed all 64. Master nope. Instant first prize. So I get something nasty, something greasy, and the skill sneeze dart or snooze dart. Yay! The trappers would be so proud. And my foot's asleep. I don't know why. Maybe it's because of this bracelet I'm wearing. Yeah, a little little peace of mind. I have to wear a brace sometimes, but not all the time, though. The my leg's in good condition. With how the kid handled the shingle. Yay! So pretty much. I need to work on something, which is something nasty, or... Eh. What else could I do? Looking at all these, I got a couple of upgrades. But the only thing I can do, for one, is definitely the Gallon Mortar. Where's the mortar? There it is. Boundless Bay. Oh, and keep in mind, I'm not going to do all... I'm not gonna do all the proving grounds, just the required ones that I need. Because if you do, if I can do all the ones, all the proving grounds, that would be good. Ceylani is our can, because I suck at this site, and our ship's mortars were unstoppable. At Boundless Bay, our navy put those mortars through a rigorous inspection. I kind of like how it's on a tropical island. Had to use squirts to simulate explosive impact. Let go. On the surface of the sea. Bloom. And I completed the skippers. Galleon skippers needed to be patient. Pretty easy achievement. Needed to fire at just the right times. A couple of more. Sounds like the kids more. And I got a second prize. You're supposed to get 80. You're supposed to get 80 of them because it'll say in three, two, one, 80 or more casualties. So this one's a pretty easy feat. The only if problem you is you gotta do it at the exact artillery. moment without fucking up. So let go. Boom. A variety of modifications could be used to enhance the power. Let go. If the galleon mortar couldn't squish it. Letting go in three, two, one. Fifty-two, three, two, one. Eighty-three. Eh, might as well go for a couple more. You could almost see so, I got first prize. That was easy. <laughs> Yay! Sorry if this video is kind of boring. This is just me doing uh, p proving grounds. Since we're not going to go save Zeo on, on the spot because that's going to take a while. Consider this as filler for me. Not rec not actually coming back to record because I've been busy. Good lot, thing so. we got to that mortar before the beasts of the wild learned how to use it. And that's a good thing. But we got. Him.
Eight five hundred more. Delivered us from the motherland. Now we can go upgrade something. What can I upgrade? Let's see. Something greasy. I can upgrade something heavy, but I don't wanna. Could I upgrade this, but I already did it. Oh wait, that's the only thing I was trying to do. Fuel generation. Without an insulated air intake, that thing's liable to blow up on you. Alright, now let's go back. Let's go back to the bellows and show those peckers once and for all that I can cook you all like fried chicken. Then give you to KFC so people that can go there can eat it. I prefer Popeyes, most likely. Popeyes is more better. Yes, I know the gravy. I was going to say gravy generator. It's the Grady Incinerator. Kill all the things. And you're dead. Okay, now I gotta hurry. You don't really need all the upgrades of the incinerator. Or the bellows. You just need enough just to kill them all. And I didn't get it. Yep, I didn't get it. You're supposed to get 70 or more. Seventy-two. Damn. I think I have to try this again. What you're supposed to do, I'm guessing, I am taking a while to guess that you have to get them to, to surround you. Say it like this, and then kill them all. There we go. Or just walk around. Yep, walking around, and I'm almost done. Gonna kill all the rest of these. Yes! All 72 peckers. Dead. Wasn't any other way to Booyah. teach those peckers some respect. And I've got the last skill. So I completed the service. Damn, I'm good. I completed a lot of vigils in this. I don't know how. I completed one with the mortar, I completed one with the bellows, I completed one with the service. The only one I haven't completed was the one for the proving grounds, which I'm pretty much gonna try to do in this video. It's long, good. If it's Who not, then eh, so at least I'm fast at it. Trash. Let's see, the service. I think I just need three more proving grounds. The service for all the And I got the Jelante, which is complete fifty percent of the memorials. Let's see. That's gonna be hard, because I'm almost done with that and that. Oh boy. Hmm, what could I do? Let's see. Oh, I knew what I can do. Trigger Hill. This is actually the easier one. Or one of the easy ones. If I can't get it done in this Say clip, I'm going to be done. Only took the best, and the best of them trained on Trigger Hill. The Triggers believed they were nothing without their rifles. Trigger Hill actually sounds like a cool name. Let's see. Nothing beats the fear of shooting a Ceylonian army carbine. Bluey. Bluey. Wait a minute. Where are the rest of the targets? Oh, the flowers too. To take care to stay Didn't know shot. that. Boom. Triggers had clearance to modify their guns, however they chose. Boom. So Boom. The course was too easy. So Boom. Spice things up a bit. Boom. 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 And boom. The kid ain't bad. But the triggers were better. Okay, so I got second prize. I think I have to get under 30 seconds. Let's see. Yep, under 35. Okay. That's easy. I just forgot that I had to destroy the if flowers. You master the art of the firearm, then the place to go was Trigger Hill. Master of the firearm. I'm more of a fan of the knives, thank you very much. Boom. 
Boom. Boom. He had to shoot from the hip. <laughs> Boom. Boom. Keep moving to avoid getting burned. Boom. Oh crap, I missed. Boom. Boom. I'm just gonna keep saying boom every time I shoot them. Boom, heal. Oh, I can't heal. That sucks. Boom. Oh crap, 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 crap. Crap. Through that course like it was Aww. One chance left, and I got first prize. First death in the game. Ain't that a bitch? <laughs> that is just a bitch. I don't know why. It's like, oh, I finally beat it. Then all of a sudden, death. Funny how games can do this to you. And the the army would have recruited him in a flash. No, you kind of wouldn't, because I would be dead on the front lines. I think. Oh, that's actually the easy one. The triggers, my brothers, bravest men I ever knew. I think because of that little sentiment that he made, that Rux was actually a part of the military. So yeah, we'll just go with that. So, hmm, what can I? Ooh, I can improve some weapons here. Hmm, I can improve that already. Improve, improve these, but probably not gonna. Anyways, I'm gonna stop it here. Next time, we're gonna do some more Proving Grounds or go to Zultan Hollow. If you like this part, yeah, you can do whatever you want. So we'll be again this is live with the Amish Man and Kevin Amish and one and all, so goodbye, farewell, do, but most importantly, so I'll see you in the next episode, so, mm, ta-ta.